This is a production of World Video Bible School. To God be the glory. What are the Ten Commandments? The Ten Commandments are a portion of the law of God that was given to the ancient nation of Israel. These Ten Commandments were actually written on stone tablets and were given to Moses. Now, in addition to the Ten Commandments, there were actually 603 additional directives, meaning that there were a total of 613 precepts which composed the law of Moses. You know, many times today, the Ten Commandments become the center of controversy because they will be engraved on a public building or they will be part of a public monument and some people won't like that. And you'll have one side who will vehemently oppose such a monument because they believe it's a violation of church and state. And then you'll have the other side who strongly supports such a monument because they believe that the Ten Commandments represents God's law to man. A proper understanding, however, will show us that first, the Ten Commandments were never given to all of mankind. They were a part of a special covenant between God and the nation of Israel. In Deuteronomy chapter 5, verses 2 and 3, when Moses rehearsed the Ten Commandments to the people of Israel, this is what he said. He said, The Lord our God made a covenant with us in Horeb. The Lord did not make this covenant with our fathers, but with us, those who are here today, all of us who are alive. And so Moses pointed out very clearly that these Ten Commandments were given to a specific and a very select group of people, namely the nation of Israel. But more importantly for us to understand is that the Ten Commandments do not apply to mankind today. The Ten Commandments are a part of the old law which Colossians 2.14 says was nailed to the cross. Romans chapter 7 and 2 Corinthians chapter 3 specifically cite the Ten Commandments as being a part of the old law that was done away. You see, today we live under the law of Christ, not the law of Moses and not the Ten Commandments. Now, does that mean that we are okay with murder or with taking the Lord's name in vain or with stealing? Of course not. But you see, the reason that we are opposed to these things today is not because the Ten Commandments prohibited them, but rather because these things are included in the law of Christ. In fact, each of the Ten Commandments, except one, is repeated in the New Testament. The one exception is, remember the Sabbath day to keep it holy. Now because that one is excluded, we do not teach or practice the Sabbath day as a part of modern-day Christianity.